Let's see if I can land a strike. Nope. Ah, well, that was pretty bad, I guess. I have something to confess. I've not been feeding my glow box and now they all died. I need a way that is more fun than the factory to feed my glow box. I need something round for my plan, but all round plans are destructible. At least in creative I can build four round things, but this one is too large and I can't even move it. The other thing isn't really round and this thing is too large as well, but if I could build this ball, that's exactly what I need. But I don't know if I can get rounded frame corners in survival. Because I'm too lazy to go into the warehouse and die, I'm just going to ask people on Reddit. Once I have the ball, I can easily go bowling. Apparently glass has some low friction, so maybe I can combine hockey and bowling. Looks like saw blades have even less friction. I can even use them on the ground. So my plan is that I use cardboard to create the pins, then I can use glow box to delete this block, then I have my pins, I can shoot my bowling ball, then I can do this to get rid of all the pins, and down there will be glow box which eat all the cardboard pins, this producing me more poop. Then I only need to find a way to return the ball to the <laughs> beginning. Well, I've managed to build something that looks somewhat round. I mean, it's still better than those scrap wheels for sure. Even dog shit would make for better wheels. Um, but yeah, that's pretty okay. If someone can answer my question on Reddit, I will go to the warehouse. And if no one answers, I will use this thing instead. See you guys in a few hours. So someone answered me on Reddit. And yes, we can find those things in the warehouse and it's supposed to look like this. I can't say how thrilled I am to go into the warehouse. I guess it's time to prepare for war. Right, I need either broccoli or pineapples to get a gun that is better than my standard spot gun. And guess where you can find these? In the warehouse. <sighs> I've spent so much time building this thing and now I can't even use it to make better guns. I'll need a lot of potatoes. Well, and my Canadian look is way too friendly. Alright, I need my tough military headband. And the mightiest moustache on the planet. My torso is going to be my bare chest. I'm going to kill those bots with my bare hands. Like a real man. Well, and the only pair of trousers that I have. Well, except these. But they look more manly. Yeah, those shoes at least look sturdy. Yeah, I think I'm going with the trash can. That's where all the bots are going to end up anyway. To enter the warehouse, we must prove ourselves worthy by slaying one of the great beasts. I think I spotted one of these rare creatures at the horizon. Here we can see one of the rare boss spots in its natural habitat, close to one of the warehouses. Listen to the unique sound of the boss spot. It's the loudest spot of them all. And here you can see the boss bot getting angry at the cameraman. man. Uh, wait, wait, the cameraman, that's me. Um, yeah, and now here you can see the cameraman running away. And, oh, ah, I finally managed to uh, reactivate the GUI. I think I'm in quite a lot of trouble. Uh, so we just keep running away until I get in an, into an ad advantageous position. Whoa, it's shooting stuff only takes a couple of hundred potatoes. But the old running around the rock trick seems to work. Nope. Ah, maybe I, maybe I can hide inside the lock. Nope. Um, the lock is too huge. Maybe I should have thought this through. <gasps> I've did it, I've killed the boss bot. <coughs> Look at that durability. Well, that only took about 50 potatoes. I should also mention, if I die inside the warehouse, I have to kill another red bot and do all of this again. Alright, I'm at the warehouse. There's one guard. Aim for the head and... One hit. Move on to next position. Can you hear it? I think there's another bot. Looks safe. I'm advancing. I've scouted another bot. Get back, I need new cover. Let's sneak in from the right side. Scout the area. I can't see another bot, so quickly run to the other side. There's a tree in my vision. Man, that was so epic. <laughs>
Right, I can't see about here. Bot found. Aim for the head and... Dang it. He hit inside the tree. Horror! I'm hearing bots. Bot at 12 o'clock. Dang it. Got him. Right, there's another bot hiding there. Yeah, that... Well, that worked out fine. Bot from behind. Dang it. That was the wall. That was the wall again. But the bot ran away, so quickly advance. I can hear a walk. Huh, a walk is in danger. Quickly sneak up behind the next pillar. Alright. Yes, headshot. Can see the exit. Bot at 12 o'clock. And something mysteriously <laughs> blocked the shot. <laughs> and again. And again. What the hell is wrong with this corner? Alright, let's advance from the other side. Oh, it's there. But I've headshotted it. Okay, quickly insert the warehouse key. Ah, of course I need to call the elevator. Yeah. The elevator is coming. Ah, there it is. Okay, still got enough potatoes left. All right, the entrance seems to be clear, but I can hear bots. All right, first area seems to be clear. There's no way back now, except the way of cowardice. All right. One, two, three. Charge! Ah, and run away. Get cover. Yeah, but here's no cover. There's just paper. Ah, here's cover. They didn't even notice. All right. Whoa, this triggered them. Oh my gosh. Ah! Ah! <laughs> That's why I don't go into the warehouse. All right, so I think I'm just going with this ball because you saw what is going on in the warehouse. That's something for like another time. So now I need to rescue my old car. Uh, I've run into some kind of problem. Um, and my car got stuck where at some corn. <coughs> and now I'm in some kind of bad situation. Ha, ah, screw you guys, I'm going home. So I figured a few things out. First, I want to place the pins like this, so you can't land a strike too easily. Because if I know this, yep, it requires some skill. So, I'm using scrap wood for the ball. And for the track, I'm going to use a layer of glass. And underneath, a layer of wood. So, I guess I can farm these resources. So, glass can be crafted from sand and amber. Sand can be made from stone. Luckily, I've got enough stone to stone people for decades to come. So I just need to farm more amber. I already deforested half of this area. Well, now the whole thing is cleared. And I filled my whole chest with amber. Now I only need some wood. Haha, it works. Oh, my car! <laughs> oh, God. Turns out the big trees give you wood blocks, so I didn't even have to craft them. So I've got a rough sketch for my bowling alley. So I go up here and then I hammer the bowling ball and... Well, that wasn't great, but the pins fall down here and where the scrap metal is, there are going to be glow bugs who eat all the cardboard things. Then I uh, push the ball with pistons or something else somewhere here so in the end the bowling ball is somewhere up here i can place it on the lift again then put it on the bowling alley and start bowling again and i think i've destroyed a glass block and now i get to work by grinding 10 vacuum pumps and chests and vacuum pipes and stuff I also don't have enough space under the bowling alley to use glow bugs, so I need to use spud cannons to shoot the cardboard and not the glass. I have a farm now, but I don't farm bananas or blueberries. I at least already know where the packing station for these is. 
I need 10 bananas just for one crate. There goes the first spot cannon. Man, I wish I had a vacuum pump like this. <laughs> Thank you. My first spot gun. I almost forgot about the ammo container, but that's actually quite cheap. I think I have enough red beads. <laughs> Looks like I've removed the vacuum pump that was supposed to be here a while ago. So I'm just going to drive all the way back again. Well, I just realized that I don't even have banana seeds. Oh, and I triggered another raid. Well, I forgot the vacuum pump so I can drive back again. There we go. And for banana seeds I need carrots. Oh, Alright, time to get some carrots. Not that I run out of carrots anytime soon. Wait, didn't I have the same problem again? And didn't I then discover that I can just use vacuum pumps instead of spot guns? While loading red beads into this thing, I've noticed that I could just use those vacuum pumps to shoot potatoes instead. Well, I'm going to use spot cannons now anyway, just because I can. There we go. Well, I've run out of fuel, so now I need to carry the car home. Well, I didn't do anything, but the car disappeared from the lift, so now I need to walk all the way back. Hmm. Is there something I can do to make the plants grow faster? Hmm. Maybe they want some music. Grow plants! Grow! I need to fulfill my evil master plan. Well, this is Dr. Pixel from the farm and we are doing great. You can already see the plants maturing into the lovely adult life. Where they will be brutally capitated by some mechanic who needs bananas. For science. What are these farm bots doing? Why are they on my car? Hi. Yeah, well, they just do nothing. Well... Well, my farm got a little overrun and I've lost about half of my crops. Uh, yay. Did I already mention that I hate climb diving? So my hard farm work paid off. So I've got all of these crates and just one car. Now I know why my cart has been driving so weird. This wheel is just one block off. I mean, it fits. And I can still drive this thing. I don't know where the problem is. Oh. No! I don't know where the problem is. Well, this actually drives... <laughs> uh oh. No, 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 no. <laughs> now there we go. One, two, three. I also finished the system that places the pins. So now I just need to assemble everything together. What? What the? Isn't that my car? What the hell happened? Ah, I need to stop my car. Ah, I had it. Dang it. No! <laughs> My car! <laughs> ah, they destroyed the seat! The stupid haybots! And I let them live! Hi. No, my car! <laughs> oh, I can just put it on the lift, right? Well, I've managed to run out of scrap stone, so I now need to go mining again. Oh my god, those suspensions are glitching out again. My idea with placing spot cannons here doesn't really work, because those would destroy those pins before they would destroy those blocks. So I need pistons and sensors and everything. Spot cannon test number one, and... It works! So, if I press this button now, I should be able to place the pins, if this thing doesn't go wibbly wobbly. Nope! Uh... Well, now it works. Nope. Well, I forgot two connections. But now it works. Nope. Well, now it works. 
Nope. What's wrong with this? But now it finally works. Nope. Wait, what? Well, another try. And it worked! As promised. So... Whoops. Well, I found a piece from the cardboard factory. <laughs> this thing needs a ton of blocks. Luckily, I still have a ton of forest. I did some progress, I installed a lot of pistons to get the ball up there again, and I just need to collect everything with some logic stuff, and we are good to go. Hello, little toad bot. Okay, little toad bot. Back to clan diving. Everything should now work if I press this button. The pins get pushed to the side. I also placed a bowling ball there. Now the bowling ball gets pushed over there. Then the pistons activate and push the ball. Hmm. But we've got new pins. Nope. So if I now try again, the ball gets where it needs to be. It's still quite fast. But the ball got up again. Looks like I need about five more glow bugs. Well, I forgot how long this takes. <sighs> well, it's all for the glow bugs. <sighs> Ah! My glow box! You... Ah! God. Okay, they are all still alive. Alright, all six glow box are there. Whoa, they killed themselves. Well then, I guess it's time for some bowling. Okay, please don't fail me now. I'm pretty sure I fixed it. Yes, I did. Probably shouldn't stand on the track. Alright, this worked perfectly. Uh, let's place the bowling ball. Well, that's not in the middle, but I don't care. Let's see if I can land a strike. Nope. Ah, well, that was pretty bad, I guess. So the glow bugs are now eating the cardboard. Yes, they eat the cardboard. Well, let's try again. And <laughs> I really hope the ball gets where it needs to be. Because now there's stuff going on down there. It worked! <laughs> and... Well, not a strike again. Yeah, they eat some of it. But there's still cardboard left. Oh my god. Everything's full of cardboard. Oh my god. Oh, it's already getting laggy. I'm not even sure if it's possible to land a strike. And that was the glass. Well, only three pins left. I mean, <laughs> probably it's possible. Yep, only four of them are alive. <laughs> oh my god. Well, and we've got our first poo. Well, now both balls are up here. And I thought it wouldn't work. Great. Come on. Can't be too difficult to land a strike. God dang it. All right, time for another try. Oh, it's difficult. Yeah, there it is. Well, it's much more fun to operate than the factory, t to be fair. And actually less laggy. <laughs> yeah, this thing is actually pretty fun to use. 
It's just that I suck and didn't land a strike so far, so I'll just keep trying until I land a strike. How long is that gonna take, hey? Oh, looks like I've got a present here. <laughs> well, that's not a ball. Alright. Oh, come on, I can do it. Ah! Nah. Here goes nothing. Well, here broke my glass. Wow, only two glow bugs are still alive. Oh my god. Why did I even die for six then? Be one with the ball. Nah! Okay, they can do it. It's just one punch. Aww. I'm so bad, I already ran out of potatoes. Yup! Yeah. Oh, I missed. <sighs> Just do it! <sighs> Here it goes. <sighs> well, at least I've got another ball. Well, enough is enough, before I get another paper jam. <laughs> well, if you like what I do, then like what I do and subscribe and stuff. Oh god. Oh god, it's so close. Holy shit. <laughs> ah! Oh. Ooh. <laughs> well, that didn't tickle. Oh. Oh my god. Thanks for watching until the end.